hello guys and welcome to another video so in this video i'm going to group it into four sections first i'll teach you how you can create real derive account second i'll teach you how you can create real derive meta to the five account third part is i'll show you how you can link the derive meta to the five account you created to your meta to the five app on your phone then the last part is i'll show you how you can fund the meta to the five account that way you can be able to trade with it on the meta to the five app and also how you can withdraw the profit you made while you were trading on the Meta Trader 5 app. This video is actually for those who have been practicing on the Rip Demo account and they feel that they have practiced enough to start making real money in trading the market. And if you're new to trading, you're a beginner trader, I think you should visit my website, mikofsacademy.com and take advantage of the free beginner's forest trading class. It contains about eight lessons and uh, so many sub lessons, guys. If you're also new to this channel, do consider subscribing. Also, click the bell icon beside it. That way, you get notified anytime I upload a new video. So, I'll be doing this presentation with my smartphone. Why am I using a smartphone to do the presentation? Simply because everybody uses a smartphone. Everybody owns a smartphone, okay? So, okay, guys, when you log into your platform, this is exactly what you're going to see. So, since you've been practicing on demo, this shouldn't be new. So the first thing we're going to do is to create real Deriv account. There are two ways you can actually do this. First is to drop down this icon here. Then you click on the real button here and add account. Okay. But I'm not going to use this method. This is the method I'm going to use. So you click this menu icon here. Then click Traders Hub here. You see this button here that you see demo. You drop it down and click on real so now we are on real then you go to derive account only derive account forget about this d trader d bot and the rest of it you see this derive account you click on get here is where you choose the currency you click on us dollar then you scroll down to the next button down there you click next button then here you put your first name here you put your last name here you put your date of birth and here you put your phone number. Make sure the name and the date of birth must correspond with that on your ID card. So once you done filling all this thing, then you click the next button. So I'll fill mine now. Okay guys, I'm done filling out the information. So I'll just click this next button right here. At this page will pop up. Here you put the address, first line address, which is compulsory. The second line address is not compulsory. You can leave it vacant. Then you put your city, put your state and province. Put your poster or zip code if you don't know the poster code or zip code of the town you're staying at just go to google and google a zip code of whatever whichever state you're staying all right then once you're done filling it you click the next button so i'll go ahead and fill mine now as i'm done filling out the information so i'll just click this next button here is where you verify your id how do you verify your id you drop down this button right here then it depends on the country you're from i'm from nigeria so the two options i'm seeing here is driver's license and national identification number that's nin if you're in nigeria everybody has nin if you don't have nin that means you're not a human being sorry <laughs> you're not a nigerian so if you want to use driver's license just select driver's license okay and if you select driver's license you input your document number here and go ahead and click the next button this verification does not take it doesn't take up to 30 minutes or if you want uh, to verify with national id uh, your nin just click on nin input your nin number here and click the next button okay there's no option to upload it it's just the number that you need to input but if it fails that means they will require you to snap it and upload it in most cases they require to add your birth certificate with it so if you don't have a birth certificate just go to any local government and get one that's if you're in nigeria make sure it is stamped if it's not stamped it won't be approved okay once you're done filling out that information that is you're done creating a real derive account all right once you're done creating the real account the next thing you need to do is to create real derive meta trader 5 account so i'm done creating my real derive account and how do you know you have created a real derive account you can know by just dropping down this button right here demo is already is there already then if you click real you see us dollar account okay see this us dollar account so my real account is created already so the next thing i need to do is to create 
real derive metatrader file account how do you do that let me show you click this menu icon right here the next thing you click this traders up here you look here if it's not real then you click it and make sure you select real okay so if it's on real the next thing you need to do is you click on cfds click on cfds because i've added a derive metatrader 5 account that's why you're seeing transfer or trade here under derived you see get like this get it. this one is if you want to trade currency pay and cryptocurrency you can click on it this derived is for synthetic indices so you click the get because i've already created an account so if you click the get they will show you something like this always go with the one that suits your country more or if you're in nigeria just go with the first one saint vincent okay you click on it click on next and create a derive meta trader 5 password so any password you use here that's what you're going to use to link your real account to the meta trader 5 account you know how you created your demo and how you linked your demo account to meta trader 5 is the same process it's same procedure okay so make sure you use the password you remember then you click on add account maybe later so here you click on trade the broker is derive limited server is derive server and login is this and password is this you already know your password so what you just need to do is to copy your login id you click the button here to copy it you can write it down if you want to write it if you don't want to copy it automatically then so once you copy it you can go to your meta trader 5 app on your phone and link it so how do you do that so this is the meta trader 5 app so you just click this button click manage account then click the plus button right there then derive limited you search it you might not see it already typed so before you finish typing they will show you the real limited you just click on it you paste the login id that you copied you paste then type in your password then the server remember it's the server they have the server one and the server two make sure you select the real server so if it's the risk server, you select the risk server. If it's the risk, the risk server to make sure you select the, the risk server too, okay? So it was the risk server, so I'll just click on the risk server. Then I'll just go ahead and click login. That's how you're gonna link it. You already know what to do from here because if you pass through my beginner's class on my website, you already know the, what to do from here. After linking your derive meta to the five account to the derive meta to the five app, how do you fund it? Let me show you how you fund it and also how you can withdraw money from it for you to be able to fund your derive meta trader 5 account you first need to deposit on your derive account as you can see i have ten dollar here what i just need to do is to move this ten dollar to my derive mt5 account so that i can be able to trade with it on the meta trader 5 app on my phone if you don't already know how to deposit on your derive account i've done several videos on it if you go to my website mikrofs academy under the beginners forex trading class once you open it there are about eight lessons one of the lessons is a deposit just click on the deposit and withdrawal lesson then you see different deposit and withdrawal options there that you can use to fund your derive account okay so once you're done funding your account and you want to now use it to fund your derive meta trader 5 account this is what you do just click this menu icon here then click the cashier button then click the transfer button then you select the amount you want to deposit. I want to deposit $10. Then you click on transfer. That's just it, guys. The funds has been sent to your real derived Meta Trader 5 account. So just go to your Meta Trader 5 app and start trading with it. Remember, before you start trading your account, definitely you must have had a demo account where you practice and learn how to trade. If you have not practiced with a demo account, that means you need to go through my Forex Beginners class on my website, microfsacademy.com, and learn how to trade before you start trading with real money. To go back, you click this cancel button right here. Then click this menu icon. Go to derive.com. Then get trading. That's how you get back to this page, okay? If you made profit, trading on the Meta Terra 5 platform. How then do you withdraw the fund from MetaTrader 5 back to your derivative account? Let me show you. 
So what you just need to do is to still click this menu icon here, click cashier, then click transfer. What you just need to do is to, to drop down this button right here, then select the account you want to transfer from, which is your delivery method to five account. Then which account are you transferring to? This happens to be our dollar account. Okay. Now let's type in the amount we want to withdraw from our Meta Trader 5 account. Let's assume it's $10. Then you just click transfer. Immediately the fund will be transferred back to your derive account. So if you go back to your derive account, you see the $10 there. So let's go back, go to derive.com, then click get trading. So that's it. As you can see, the fund is back. So this is how you can fund your Derive Meta Trader 5 account from your Derive account and also withdraw from your Derive Meta Trader 5 account back to your Derive account. So from here, you can send it to your bank account. Okay, I've done a video on that. That's just it, guys. That's just it, guys. So if this video was helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and also subscribe to the channel. Talk to you in my next video.